Your peace of the gods. I love myself. Open your eyes so I can see. Got you all in check. From God, to him, I'm a yacht. It's my protector. It's going to clean this planet up. You feel me? Hear my soul, my spirit, my heart, and mind. Find a light within me. Find a God within me. Shout out to my kings and queens, all my gods and goddesses out here. You feel me? You and I are in tune with your higher self. No weapon form against me will prosper. You go against me, you're going to get yourself. And the universe will make you suffer for you're going to get yourself because I'm your higher self. Peace to the gods. I love myself. Okay, in this video right here, I'm going to be talking about some important topics right now. You feel me? I know you see the um the picture that I got up there for the video. You got to understand, certain places are a target. Certain, certain places are are being shut down. You feel me? Certain places in the United States of America is going to be shut down. You got to understand, the government shut down is not going to affect everybody. It's going to affect certain places. Like I said, certain places is being a target. That's why you see all these floods. You feel me? And, and this the one thing you do got to understand is this. The whole inner structure, the whole inner structure, the whole inner structure, how the way they build certain places, they do they build all this on purpose they design everything on purpose like all that flood happening in new york all the floods happening in certain places like that the infrastructure wasn't built to protect the u.s citizens from natural disasters you feel me and then they burn it um they keep um spilling the blood from the earth and burning fossil fuels to give us gas electricity and all the shit that we got out you know um allowing our waters to run through apartment units and shit like that you gotta understand all that's affecting the earth too and you gotta understand elon musk the powers that be the people that run the world they really trying to clean the planet up they're really trying to find ways that we can keep the system alive but we can harvest solar energy from the sun and you gotta understand certain places that you live in it is not giving up and is not giving enough radiation for solar energy to keep the system power up and certain places are being attacked it certain places is going to be shut down certain places is going they're going to stop restrictions they're going to start you know um forcing mandatory uh shutdowns on um ac heat and all types of shit they're gonna start doing a blackout thing it, you know it's might it might not happen it didn't ha it might not did happen october the 4th though but it's coming they've been talking about it. they've been planning about this but they've been saying uh, you know um hum um humanity might not be ready for them to, to cut off certain utilities and certain type of stuff like that around the world at certain places it's because they're trying to protect the planet, but they're doing a lot of reverse psychology games. They're doing a lot of uh, putting out a lot of fear mongering, proper um, proper grammar. They're doing so much shit to to control us and put fear in us and make us uncomfortable, you know. But people is still worrying about where on uh, welfare, Section Eight, uh, food stamps. You feel me? Um, who cares about that? Who cares about welfare? Who cares about Section 8? Who cares about food stamps? Who cares about um, government assistance? Who cares about all that stuff like that? You feel me? Because if you was thinking and moving like a god and a goddess and a king and a queen, you won't be worrying about all these desires and all these attachments. And you won't be caught up in in. in and trying to beg the government or do things to try to, um, 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 yeah, 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 and, and beg the government and just do things just to get free assistance from the government because you got free will to do it instead of you going out here getting it on your own. You feel me? So, like I said, it's a lot of stuff that's going on. And, like I said, the biggest battle, this is another part of the bill on, on, this is another part of the video. The biggest battle that's going on with all countries and all nations is they trying to stay alive. You know, they they species trying to stay alive, right? 
you know, they, they species trying to stay alive. So now we they trying to immerse themselves with United States. You feel me? Because we in the 33 parallel universe and they trying to harvest the energy. It's all about solar energy. And like I said, certain places they got solar energy, most of the time it's going to be our West Coast. You feel me? West Coast is basically, you know, like place like Arizona, El Paso, Mexico, um, the middle, um, um, the Midwest and shit like that. Don't places harvest um a, a lot of radiation for solar energy. Cause like I said, the next phase of advancement of technology is everything gonna be run off solar energy. You know, they already, you know, I'm already out here, they already got cars that um and trucks that are driving by themselves you feel me without nobody in it you feel me they already got a lot of bunch of solar um towers solar devices solar towers that they already building and the sun always shining all the time 24 7 you know and you know like places like that you feel me you know, but it's it's giving out UVB vitamin um, vitamin D sunlight. That type of radiation is what is going to help harvest enough energy to keep a lot of these solar devices on. Because places that only produce UVA, that is vitamin D deficiency in them in certain places. The sun might be shining a lot, like in Florida or them other places like that. You know, in Africa. Africa got vitamin D deficiency. Africa only producing UVA. They're not producing vitamin D like that. You know, you know, most of Africa is vitamin D deficiency. So when you, uh, a lot of people, people like go to Africa. Africa is not, um, you know, they, um, Africa is not producing enough UVB vitamin D sunlight over there. It's really not. You feel me? So you need to really be somewhere where you getting UVB vitamin D sunlight because when they stop restrictions, when they start shutting stuff down, when they start mandatory lockdown, whatever they're gonna do it, they gonna really they doing it. They not doing everything is not happening again uh, um against you. The universe is not working against you. The universe is working for you in your favor, but it's hard to actually see it like that because you're so comfortable with the normal way of living, but you gotta understand the normal way of living, how the way they build the world is actually is affecting the world. And they wanna keep us programmed to the matrix. So the, for them to keep us continue to be programmed to the matrix, they gotta switch it up to another level. You know, they gonna have to start cleaning it up a little bit, you know, to keep us stuck in here, to keep us still, you know, I mean, like I said, I don't got nothing against it, man. You know, it's like, what can we do at this point? You feel me? We don't control the world. We don't control how the way the world work. But we do. And we start tapping in and going deep into our stuff internally to understand our stuff externally. Because um, your, um, um, your, um, your internal controls your external reality. You feel me? Your projection, what you see, even though it's not real, everything is temporary. Everything got an expiration date. You know, you was you, you was born into a confused system, man. You know, the people that are running the world don't even know what the fuck they're doing. They trying to figure this shit out. They trying to figure this shit out the best way they can. You feel me? They trying to understand what nature is. They trying to they trying to use technology to understand what nature is because they disconnected with nature because they came from planet Nibiru. You know, they came from a cold, a cold planet. They came from a cold planet. They never was born on a on a hot rock, on a tropical uh um planet. You feel me? When everything is around them is just giving out um hydrogen, just giving out um yeah, just giving out electricity. Everything around you is giving out electricity, but it's not a lot of places not you're not getting a lot of electricity like how you need to be certain places from the sun, you know, like that, you're not getting a lot of hydrogen and you're not getting enough solar energy, solar electricity like that because they dim, they, um, they dim the sunlight. They, you know, they, you know, they just doing, they just a lot of green gases, power plants, a lot of chemicals being put in the air, 
um, trying to, and blocking the sun and causing a lot of um, rain to come down and creating, uh, you know, water evaporations, creating acid rain it's all these different places around the planet, you know. So it, it, it's crazy, man, you know. It's really crazy. So you, you got to get close to the sun, man. You feel me? Before they start locking shit down and they stopping you from traveling and shit like that. You feel me? We got 45 days. You feel me? You know, you know, we got 45 days to understand what's going on. To work, get our bread, and go to certain places. Like I said, I don't believe all places is going to be locked down. I believe certain places around the United States is a target. Certain places around the United States is non-essential to, to keep running. You feel me? It's non-essential. In certain places around the United States, it's essential. It's a, I believe certain areas is essential and non-essential. You feel me? You know, and certain places are being targeted. Certain places are being targeted. So that's what I'm saying. Like, you got to just understand what I'm saying. You got to just do your own research, look it up. And you will see for your and you will see for yourself that Elon Musk, the government, all different type of people that control the power grid and understand what's going on. They're trying to come up with ways where they can use solar radiation, solar power to power up the system. It's going to be a lot of cars that's going to be running off solar energy. It's going to be a lot of homes and houses and apartments that's going to be run off solar energy. It's going to be a lot of stuff that's going to change over over time. But it's but they working on it. They working on it, but they say a lot of humanity ain't going to be ready for for the new type of way, the new things that's coming out here, you know, in the world. Humanity ain't gonna be gonna be ready for it. You know, it's gonna come with a lot of death. Like any, like 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 any new type of age or any type of new way of living, it's gonna come with a lot of death. Because if you're not uh, real advanced like AI, if you're not real in tune with what's happening, you don't know how to move like the animals and migrate, and you don't know how to get out the way, and you too stuck up in your way. You know, you you know, you too stuck up in your foolish ways. You're gonna be the one that's gonna be caught up in all the bullshit. When a new shift happens, you ain't gonna make it. You know, you know, because every time we level up in life, every time we go to different dimensions, you feel me? Technology gonna start changing. The way how we live is gonna start changing. You know, I we we are is gonna be more in tune. We're living on the planet, most definitely. You know, it's it, like we head in that way, but technology is gonna like actually help us out throughout the process. But it's not gonna damage the planet, and it also gonna be, you know, um, an asset to us instead of a liability. It's gonna benefit us and the planet, you know, instead of, you know, um, it destroying the planet. Technology is gonna basically help us more, it's gonna benefit us more and the planet more than what it's doing right now. But you we gotta be just be patient. We just gotta stay alive and we just gotta be in tune with our higher self and have divine knowledge of self. And you're gonna be alright. But peace and love family. I'm out. Gang.